After passing away last August at the age of 69, a former resident of the Shawtown neighborhood had his dying wish fulfilled today for his ashes to come home to where he spent his childhood. New at 10 tonight, our own Felicity Bosk attended today's ceremony and tells us about Buzz Watkins' legacy. And one of the things that Buzz wanted to do more than anything, his last request, is I want to have my ashes tossed in the Chippewa River off the Shawtown Bridge. John Kaler and Bernard Buzz Watkins were best friends all their lives. Even after Buzz moved to Georgia, the two were closer than brothers. He was kind of a, a soft-spoken, introverted kind of guy and a good listener, very intelligent. Um, and I was more of a talker, so I ended up doing a lot of the talking and he ended up doing a lot of listening. His wife, Jeannie, brought his ashes back to Eau Claire on Saturday. I met him right after he got out of the Navy. Uh, we just fell in love. To fulfill the final wish of her husband of over 40 years. And that was just one request he made, and, and I just, I had to honor that. Because this area, this growing up, this life was important to him. As a veteran of the U.S. Navy, to close the ceremony, Buzz received military honors at his eulogy. By the Shawtown Bridge, he spent so many summer days jumping off.